Hi folks, today's video, we're uh, trying out this, another homemade wire stripper we built. This is built from a treadmill. What we did, this is the, the tread rollers, and we cut the treadmill off, which I should have done the video of us putting this all together. Moved the base of it down to here, welded it in, and it still has the adjusters to tighten to tighten it all up. Now it had a, a, a range of speed DC motor in it, which is that one right over there. But the biggest DC transformer we had was 24 volt off of a, uh, a battery charger. And it would run, but it doesn't run fast enough. So we went and found this old 110 electric motor. We're hooking it up now. And um, what we'll do is get her hooked up, run some wire through it, and show you how well it works. Okay, put that piece of... Yeah, that way once we figure out what size wire, what works best, we'll mark them with paint. And then if you... Out of that casing pretty easy, isn't it? Yeah. Wonder what would happen if you ran that through what the whole thing, the whole thing, but I don't know whether it fit through the holes. You know, see the sign is top. Maybe go over in the next one, you know. A little trial and error. Try it right in that oblong hole, huh? Maybe. There you go. <laughs> Look at that. Is it smashing? Oh, yeah. It takes it right off. Ah, it's out of the casing most of the way, huh? That's nice. And there you go. A couple minutes worth of stripping. Pretty cool. So, seems to be working very well. We did have to mark certain spots where the wire went through the best. And these were coated with this black coating. And the more this is cleaned off to rough metal, the better it strips. But it's amazing. It crushes down the wire and actually squeezes the casing right off. And that's about two minutes worth of running. So now all I'm going to do is keep stockpiling it until the prices go up a little bit. Because the prices are terrible right now. So, but all you need to do, if you, I know a lot of you guys find these old treadmills. And, like I say, we adapted this motor. Just found one with the same size shaft. And it works great.
if you want, please go to my other videos. I have another homemade wire stripper that we made from a uh, metal bead locker, and it works pretty good. Uh, this, so far, is the best one we've, we've done. Uh, and if you like our videos, please hit the like button and subscribe. And we're always building this kind of stuff, working on things and yeah, trying to have a little fun. Okay, have a great day.